Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Mini Metro. That's right, we're back, and we're heading over to Osaka. We're going to bring the corners of the sprawling Osaka together with extremely fast uh, shinkishins. Uh, I'm guessing I did not pronounce that correctly, but that's okay. Anyways, let's hop on into Osaka here and build ourselves a subway. Now, if you don't know anything about Mini Metro 1, you probably haven't been paying too much, atten too much attention to the channel, um, but it's a subway building game, and you got to move people from station to station, the squares to the squares, triangles to the triangles, circles to the circles. Pretty straightforward like that. Let's go ahead and double up our speed here. But it gets harder and harder as you progress. You want to try and keep these stations alternating. That way there's no, uh, you know, 15 circles in a row. Some issues we've had in other levels. And we already got a star, a special shape out there. We'll have our hook purple line hook up out there. Uh, what else to know about this game? You got different lines you can use, different colors. Uh, we're going to try just, you know, using all of our lines here to the full effect just to make sure we're not messing around too much. I'd like to try and get a really good score. I think my last score on this level was like 1226 or something like that. I would like to beat that. In the last mini Metro video, we did pretty well in, was it Barcelona? We got over 2000. If you haven't seen that video, you should go back and check it out. It was a pretty good run. And then let's just go ahead and, you know what, we'll have the blue line zip up here and hit that triangle as well. And we got the spaghetti going already. And we'll have it hit that triangle there. Ooh, this one's spawning quite a bit. Um, and we're going to, do we want two locomotives or the Shinkanshin? Uh, let's take the super fast train and then we'll also take the line. And just to show you guys the super fast train, we'll plop it down there. And we'll just see it zip along from thing to thing. All right, purple needs to kind of go get that. We'll use our other tunnel. Not exactly ideal, but that's okay. Purple can grab that triangle on the island out there. Looks like we're at about 74, 75 people moved Wednesday here. We'll have our blue line pick up that triangle. And for now, since we're not in hardcore mode, let's just make a nice loop. There we go, break things up a little bit there. And now we got a pentagon out there. Um, all right, purple line, you are gonna go grab that. And since you have all the special, ooh, definitely all the special shapes on you now, I'm going to move that up there. We'll drag the blue line down here, and the blue line can pick up that circle. So we have a kind of an interesting shape here. I don't even know. I guess it's kind of a circle. It's kind of a loop. But it's got the, the super fast train on it, and then our normal train there. And you can see how fast it moved from this triangle to that triangle there. Red line can pick that circle up. Perfect. All right. Uh, let's take another, and ooh, finally an interchange. We've been playing this game for a long time. I've always wanted to show you guys the interchange. I think I've just been calling it the bigger station. Uh, but we'll take the interchange there, and then let's put the, the super fast train on the red line there. And then we're going to have it come down there. And because I want to break up that s group of circles, we'll have it hit this triangle here. So as it's coming this way, if it's picking up a bunch of triangles, it can bring the triangles there. Now this square is already starting to fill up quite a bit because this is kind of where our red and blue line has to drop off all the special shapes. So eventually we'll turn that probably into an interchange, but the interchange does reset the clock on the, the countdown. So we're going to hang on to that till we need it for a last second, kind of as a saving, saving grace, saving bell type thing for us. And now we got a triangle out there. We have the green line. It's Thursday. We might let this sit for a little bit and then do another line that maybe bisects the red and the blue line kind of hit all these like that. Um, and it's going to start chirping at us. Yeah, now that we got a circle down there, we can certainly do a green line kind of across there. Let's just go ahead and build it while we're waiting. Um, two triangles. We'll have it hit this circle, this circle, this triangle, and this circle down there. Perfect. So I think this next time we might take two locomotives. Uh, I know they're a little slower, but I would rather have that. Um, and just since we got the purple line and all the specials, we'll go ahead and do that. So we'll grab our two locomotives and we'll grab the extra carriage. So we'll go ahead and put one locomotive here and we'll give that extra carriage to the green locomotive. There it is. And then let's go ahead and put a slow mover on the purple line there just to help with some of those special shapes. Um, and hey, there's a diamond there. We'll go ahead and have that come out there. Perfect. And now we have a circle. Uh, I guess red line's going to have to grab that circle for us. Hopefully our super fast train can help us out there and 
Yep, it'll grab some stuff on that circle. And then blue, or do we want the green line? Maybe we'll have the green line kind of double back, hit this circle, and then hit that circle there. There, now it's connected. I could do a loop. Uh, okay, here we go, here we go. We'll loop it through this and there. All right, now we definitely got a pile of spaghetti going. 417 people moved. Man, that blue train moved all the way through that pretty quickly. Uh, this is spawning quite a bit. Here comes our larger um, slow moving train with the carriage and we'll go ahead and bring our purple line to that triangle there. Uh, let's get the super fast train and then we'll take a carriage and I think we will do, uh, do we have a super fast train on the purple line? No, let's go ahead and take this slower moving train off the purple line and we're gonna drop him there. Actually, no, I wanna, can I cancel that? No, I can't, okay. And then we'll put another super fast train there and then we're gonna give him the carriage. We'll move the slow train back to the purple line in a second. Once it comes to the station there, we'll grab him and we're gonna drop him back on the purple line there. Perfect, okay. I think that is going to work out for us. Uh, let's have, let's have the purple line hit that triangle on the way in between. There we go. And we have a circle spawning out there. We don't have a tunnel, so I can't quite get to it with the purple line. Um, so maybe we need to take the green line uh, and the green line can run out and get that circle there. Great. Green line doesn't have any squares it needs to get to. Uh, so it's got to be dropping them all off here. Uh, yep, okay, so purple. No, we'll do blue line into that circle, green line into that triangle. 606 people moved. Doing pretty good, about halfway to where I was last time. Ooh, we're going to need some tunnels to get that guy. Uh, so let's wait here, and we'll get some tunnels in a second. And then, man, it'd be nice to have another line, uh, which we don't have, so... We'll have to figure, probably extend the purple line way up there. God, it's it's spawning people fast. All right, let's take the super fast train and tunnels, purple line all the way up there, and then let's put our super fast train there so it can go pick some things up. Perfect, that's gonna prevent that from going crazy. All right, red line. Um, let's go ahead and loop our red line. It's gonna hit here, it's gonna hit here, and then it's gonna go back to that square. Uh, we got some people stacking up there that we need to pay attention to. Uh, we got two stations starting to kind of stack up. We'll have the red line grab that. 798 people moved. I'm watching this triangle. We might have to drop our interchange on it here in a second. Uh, one of these green trains, hopefully it picks somebody up here soon. It just dropped off a bunch of squares there. Um, okay, blue picked up a little bit. Let's see what this guy picks up. Okay, it picked up people here, but now we got a large stack here of squares waiting to, to get taken to the square station. Uh, we'll have it hit that triangle just to break those circles up. It's Saturday, 900 people moved. Let's see if it picks some passengers up. It did. I really need this blue train to come and pick some people up, pick some squares. Let's pause it so we don't lose and we'll just make that an interchange there. Um, wow, I almost lost that because I was not paying attention. All right, so now we gotta watch this station. Hopefully the someone picks something up. Um, swing our green line there. All right, let's get two locomotives and I guess the interchange just in case. And then we'll have this come down and grab that. And then let's put, I almost, God, I wish I had another line. Um, Let's put some blue, blue locomotives. We'll put a blue line. And then let's also do, let's also do the red line here. Um, okay, 984 people moved. Blue picked up some squares there. That's going to help out. Purple line's going to come and hit that circle there. We got a lot of chirping. I got to make sure I'm paying attention to what's going on in case I need to drop our other interchange. Uh, that square might need to become an interchange here soon. Uh, that one's not chirping, but I'm watching this square now. Okay, purple's going to hit that circle there. About halfway filled up. Let's see if it picks anyone up. It didn't. All right, it's at three quarters here. So we'll need to probably drop our interchange on it, and we're going to go ahead and make that square a nice interchange. Spawning a lot of people up here. Uh, 1,175 people moved. Kind of watching everything. This triangle starting to become overloaded as well. We don't really have any other squares spawning on this map, so that's really, God, that's really building up there, huh? Hopefully he picks up something, picked up some squares. 
we'll see what's going on. All right, purple line can come over there and pick up that triangle. Um, got a couple other stations chirping at us now. Yep, it picked up quite a few there. All right, and this circle can now join the green line. All right, let's take a let's take the super fast train in a carriage, and we're gonna put that on the blue line. And it's just hopefully it's gonna be like our square picker upper, and we'll put that extra carriage there. It should pick up. Yep, most of those squares now it should zip all the way there. Perfect. All right, and it'll pick up some other shapes for us, and we'll have purple line grab that circle there. Fourteen hundred people moved. All right, uh, this green might fill up. Okay, he's gonna come there. He's gonna pick up some stuff there. This purple line is not moving the people like we need it to move people though. The square's starting to fill up. We got, oh, that one's going back the other way. Uh, and now there's a circle down there. I guess red line will have to do that. Uh, not ideal, but you know, is what it is. Thursday, about halfway through the day of Thursday. Uh, we got some more chirping on the red line. Let's see if it helps out a little bit. Uh, that one's getting a little tight there. Nope, it's not going to pick anything up. Hopefully this guy picks some stuff up soon. He picked up that plus sign. No, we're going to blow by that. All right, I think we're going to lose to this circle here unless one of these red trains hurries up and does it, and I don't think it's going to. And we're just going to connect this even though we're about to lose. That's okay. All right, Osaka. 1,691 across 55 days. That's a... That's a pretty good run for us. I like that. We're about 400 more, almost 500 more than what I got on my first go of it. Uh, so I will take that as another W so we can keep moving on and exploring more of this mini Metro game, which you guys seem to really be enjoying and liking, and I really like too. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, comment on down below on anything you want to comment. Video quality, audio quality, commentary quality, anything and anything like that. Please, 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 please let me know. And as always, thank you so much for coming out and watching this Tooth and Scrubs gaming video, and we'll see you in the next one.